right, so here is the former UFC world title challenger, perennial heavyweight contender type, the Reem, Alistair Overeem. His crowning achievement, really, that K-1 World Grand Prix Championship in kickboxing, still in search of that elusive UFC title. No one expected him to win that kickboxing right. world championship. Right. But he went out there and he beat some of the biggest names in kickboxing history. But once he was back in MMA, he has been a true and absolute savage. From becoming the Dream World Champion, becoming the Strike Force Heavyweight Champion, he's done about everything you can do in the sport of mixed martial arts. Of course, he made his UFC debut famously against Brock Lesnar. A lot of the recent wins for the Ream have come by knockout or TKO. He'll be chasing another highlight here tonight. How about the presence of Alistair Over? Ready to make a statement here tonight. Gerard Tyson with that patented white towel, the black shorts. This is as good as it gets, champ. I mean, what an iconic look, right? I mean, it is what our childhood was made of. Watching Mike Tyson with that stare, with the posse, with the crowd walking to the octagon, ready to go and tear somebody up. Iron Mike Tyson with the white towel, the black shorts, and no socks. Dude, this is what us kids in Louisiana, we looked up to him. He was a hero. It was like he was wearing a cape because he had on the white top. And I know you've seen some of the training footage. Got a pretty good sprawl. Perhaps that's going to be useful here tonight. A lot of these heavyweights are going to try to take Tyson down. Let's see how it goes for Iron Mike tonight. Mike Tyson has stepped inside the octagon. Tyson looks ready to fight tonight. Our tail of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Now for the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Alistair Areem Overeem. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight Champion of the world, Mike Tyson! One of the best in the business, Herb Dean, is our referee tonight. All right, so Alistair Overeem getting another big fight tonight, and one that maybe he didn't expect to come down the pipe after much fanfare, Iron Mike Tyson indeed crossing into the octagon tonight. He's crossed into the octagon. Oh! This might be the biggest shot of this entire fight. He landed a massive hook to put his opponent on wobbly leg. That's a big hook. Huge left hand. Oh, landed some big shots, too. And now a left. him and now he's trying to pound him out. Great ground strikes here. Oh, good movement to avoid that strike from the top. Oh, interesting there. Oh, oh, oh. Landing massive shots. This is such a crazy fight. What a kick that one landed.
All right, well, good news is he rushed him. Bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job. And yeah, he's hurt really bad. Job at least staying upright on that. Big he lands. Trading huge shots. Let's see who's gonna be the last man stand. Closes the gap and gets the single collar time. 90 seconds now to go in the round. Overings now dealing with a cheap cut. Oh, nice takedown. Side control now, DC. A lot of options at his disposal from here. Oh, he's going for his arm now. Oh, looks like he's got the arm isolated. He's got it isolated, working toward the finish. You gotta be kidding me. How did he get out? He just stayed calm. He was able to withstand the fire, and now he finds himself out and safe. We'll see what he does here. He postures up and lands to the head. Seconds left. Wolverine's right back to the full mount here. Oh. Round two straight ahead. Hey, stop. All right, so the round is over. You see, obviously, the fighter has a cut on his cheek sustained in that round, but better to be below the eye than above it. The cut man is in there trying to close it up. Don't stand still. Your timing is off. All right, let's check out some of the action, DC, and how about the punching acumen by that fighter in that previous round? He does not waste anything. He does not loop punches. Everything's tight. Everything's precise. He's a sniper. We always talk about how he's a sniper. He is a sniper, and it showed in that exchange that allowed him to drop his opponent. Shots count. Tyson gets back up. Oh, nice yeah. 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 Strike to the head. Strike to the head. His head is well, missed on that one. Circling now towards the left. Oh, big elbow. I give one, I take one. You give one, you take one. That's how this fight is being played out. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class. Hands up, chin down. And a miss with the right hook. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Now he gets a more dominant position with the other one. He is going to start to drive knees over and over. You got to be careful here. You got to move. And there's a takedown attempt. Oh, eight touch, eight touch. Beautiful win there by Alistair Overeem. Continues to cross train at different places. Finished up this training camp. And team elevation there under Elliot Marshall and Pollard. And now, oh, we gotta keep pressing here. Could be the beginning of the end. Oh, he's got his back. Drops inside that closed guard, DC. Full guard. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or big ground and pound. Tyson's bleeding from the mouth now. A cut there on his lip. That doesn't look like fun. Oh, that'll do it! Oh, my goodness! I 
mean, you got to be kidding me with that knockout. If that is not the number one play on SportsCenter tonight, I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time. I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something, and he delivered with that beautiful knockout. We go to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 19 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. Well, who would have thought that the former boxing champion Iron...